Hi guys! I am sorry about the crappy lighting. Um, it's currently 3.30 in the morning, um, the day before Thanksgiving, so I, I, I have like no time to do this. So I have to do it right now. Um, and the lighting's awful and I'm, I'm not 100% here. Um, I've been out all day long. I've been up since like 10.30 this morning and I just want to go to sleep. So I'm going to try and get this out as quickly as possible and just jam a whole bunch of information at you. I switched my book from It's the Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown to a Charlie Brown Thanksgiving. Most people know about it. It's a television special that happens every single year. It's really short um, and most of them have giant pictures on them so there's not a whole lot of reading. It's definitely a children's book. Um, it's by Charles M. Scholes. The thing about this book is that um, the word choice is a little adult. Um, so like things like depressing. There's, there's just a few things that um, are a little bit more adult as far as their content goes. Um, but I don't think that it's not a children's book. It's just there are things that um, are a little bit older. When I was a child I went through all these themes because I grew up watching all the Charlie Brown everything every year um, so I don't consider this an issue at all. Um, parents might be a little cautious about it. It's not going to take long to read it before you read it to your child but I honestly can't think of why there'd be an issue with it. So the whole thing starts off with Thanksgiving Day I believe um, or it's the day before Thanksgiving and the phone rings and it's Peppermint Patty and she essentially invites herself over to his house for Thanksgiving dinner but he's going to his grandmother's for Thanksgiving dinner with his family and he can't really figure out how this is all going to work out and then she calls and says you know what I'm going to bring a friend um, so make that two people to add to your Thanksgiving and then she calls back again and says I have another friend that'd like to come, so that's gonna be three of us for Thanksgiving. Figure it out. So, um, he does, and he figures, I mean, it's not like a Thanksgiving feast, it's like popcorn and chips and, you know, things that little kids can make. Um, but they make a Thanksgiving dinner and Peppermint Patty's like, well, this sucks, why are you so bad at Thanksgiving? I think they all end up going to his grandmother's um, at the end, because his grandmother, you know, is like, the more the merrier, yay! Um, so it all works out. It's pretty simple. Uh, I, I liked it. Um, as an adult, it's really humorous. Um, and I, I love Charlie Brown and all things Charlie Brown. I should have worn my Linus t-shirt. Uh, oh well. I did give it 5 out of 5, um, because I couldn't find anything wrong with it. As far as children books go, it's a 5 out of 5, um, but it's obviously not my favorite book. <laughs> uh, it's really simple. The drawings are fantastic, uh, very beautifully done. I don't know how to explain it, they're so classically Charlie Brown. They have that um, like old classic cartoony feel to it. Um, it's really nice and I, I really like the illustrations and I really like the story as well. Um, I would recommend it to anyone who's reading Thanksgiving books and trying to explain Thanksgiving to their children. Um, they do go over the general meaning of Thanksgiving um, and I know that it's become a political issue um, in our society recently, um, but they go over just the purpose of giving thanks for what you have, um, which is really nice, and it's nice to instill that in children, and you know, be thankful for everything that you have, um, and take time to remember the things that um, you are given and not take them for granted. So that puts me um, at almost completely done with November Thanksgiving books. I have one book left, um, The Betrayed, um, by Heather Graham, like this close to finishing it. Um, I had to change up my December reading list a little bit. Most of the books that I chose were unavailable at the library. Oh, sorry, it's really late. Um, they're unavailable um, or it was going to be a really long time to put them on hold. Um, so Charlie Brown Thanksgiving, um, definitely go pick it up at the local library. It's like, 
I don't, I don't even know. It's, it's pretty cheap if you want to just go buy it. Um, but I didn't have to wait at the library at all to get this, and Thanksgiving is in days. Um, so you can probably still pick it up if you'd like to. Um, it's past Thanksgiving now. I know I'm not going to edit this video um, in the next the next 20 hours, considering that I have to sleep for eight of that and also work for another eight of that. Um, probably not going to get this out before Thanksgiving. <laughs> um, but you can still read it in November and talk to your children about being thankful. Yeah, so I'm gonna go take a shower and go to bed because I need I need a nap. <laughs> um, I will see you guys again soon with another video. I'll see you guys later.